Hi everybody, this is a video of the Philips 250 watt high pressure sodium light bulb. As you can see here, it says on here uh, Philips Power Tone Sun, and it always says Sun on it, S O N. That's usually usually mean with for boys. But as you can see on the on the right hand side of the carton, it's got this little twinkling star. It reminds me of that. Uh, uh, Raymond Briggs film it's called the bear because that big twinkling star and that little lass in it so anyway and it says on here uh, on the in that little uh, square area um, do not connect to direct main supply without a ballast and on the bottom it says connect to direct main supply with the ballast which is usually called the transformer and on the bottom left hand corner it says Philips so and it says a uh, open box on on each side so on, uh, and it's, uh, it says on it um, 1899 but it costs 15 pounds and this is another bulb I've got from the shop today as well as that mercury vapor one that sylvania one so as you can see it says on it sun Philips power tone sun sun comfort 250 watt e in the triangle e40 that stands for edison 40 and all them six numbers is a uh, 182197 so and it says made in belgium and it's got this ce on it so and um so anyway i'm going to get it out of its uh, box you'll see in one second everybody so it's easy to get this out so it's a bit scruffy the the box well not too scruffy but a little bit collided at the bottom so i put its a uh, box on the breakfast tea table so anyway here i have the uh, the 250 watt high pressure sodium light bulb uh, and as you can see, it's got this printing right at the bottom towards this uh, stainless steel bayonet cap. And it says on it, Philips. Yeah. And it says on it, 9B. Or does it say 98? Oh, yeah. It says on it, 9B. I couldn't really see in the distance, but it says, Philips, Sun Comfort 250 Watt, made in Belgium. So, and it's got the stainless steel uh, Edison 40 screw cap so that's Edison 40 and inside this has got the sodium out tube inside these one of these high pressure sodium bulbs are quite friendly type of bulbs I suppose they, they look very friendly when I look at these type of bulbs um, when you turn it off and turn it back on it comes back on instantly so well anyway guys I'm going to uh, get it into the socket now so alright here we go it's, uh, it's screwing down now it's tightening down so we we'll make sure I don't break the bulb and everything. I really mustn't over tighten this lamp. So I'll just make sure it's a oh right, oh it's right, it's fitted in now, it's fitted in like so. So anyway guys, it's I'm going to uh, turn off this daylight lamp now. So right, that's it now, the daylight lamp's gone out. So onto the high pressure sodium light bulb, everybody. Ready? <clears throat> Ready everybody? After three, one, two, three. Wow, as you can see, that one's shining more orangey, but all around my room, it's shining very dull orange to start with, but I didn't think it usually comes on like a very lilac-y color, but let's, let's take a good look at it before it changes purely and simply orange. But on the camera, it looks very, uh, very lilac white uh, glow, but from my eyes, it looks a very peachy glow, but right in the middle through that white coating, the the gas inside the sodium out tube is shining very lilac colour, but as you can see, it's, cha it's changing very bluish colour. But but oh, look at it now! It's starting to change orange again. But funny, it just come on that type of orange when I first turned when I fired it up. But as you can see now, it's changing into the sunrise glow. Hey, the sun's rising now, so we're coming up to 250 watts of light from the sodium bulb. Let's take a look around my room. Oh, it looks very it looks very more yellow on camera. It's like sunflower yellow yeah so it's very nice it's like you know like bus station all in a lot of bus stations these lamps were all fitted with sodium bulbs and they all started to change into metal halide but now i suggest they all become led ones now so and as you can see it's starting to more orangey looking very orange it makes all the photos show all black and white yeah so well, let's take a good, another good look into it, shall we, everybody? So, as you can see, it's um, it's shining, it's shining more uh, like a very yellowy vanilla colour on the camera. But for my eyes, it shines more amber, which is usually like um, orangish yellow. So, let's take a good look at its carton whilst the bulb has reached its full brightness, like it nearly has. It says on it, Philips Power Tone Sun. They call it Sun because it shines 
like a sun, but it's got an O in it, but sun has a U in it. But sun, as though it's a, a sun to parents, it's, it's got an O in it. Like it says son, but it's pronounced sun. But as you can see, it's got this little twinkling star. It reminds, and also it reminds me of the, the Walt Disney advert when that little kid grabbed that bright star, well, the bright star from the sun, well, not from the sun, from the night sky. He grabbed uh, that that star from the night sky and he made itself into Walt Disney. Yeah, and that was all to do with the new millennium, which that was about 19 years ago. Yeah, so, and as you can see, uh, it's got this, uh, it's all coloured white and it says on it, 1899 but it was actually 15 pounds but the mercury bulb that i've got the same as, as well as the sodium cost 20 pounds but this one's 15 pounds this sodium vapor bulb well as you say sodium it says on it sun comfort 250 watts it's got edison 14 it's got the barcode it says made in belgium and it says recycle carton recycle carton on each side so and it's got this ce and everything so there's nothing else to say, but the bottom looks a bit, looks a bit, little bit eroded, mind you, because of its age. But I must be careful with this, because this is ripping away. So, well, anyway, that's enough of its box now. So I'll take a good look at this, uh, this bulb itself. So, as you can see, it's um, it's shining very, oh, shining more orangey now. So, as a, as I look all around my room, it's shining more, um, very orangey well more yellow well yellowish white but on the camera but from my eyes it shines more um very orangey color yeah so and it does make a very loud humming noise let's take another good look at this bulb now it's shining very vanilla color on the camera when i hold it very closely and let's look over above as you can see it's uh you can't really see you can see the sodium arc tube inside but it looks more white yeah so, as you can see, but you can hear that humming noise. It's actually the ballast that's making the humming noise. Yeah, so, well, well. anyway, guys, I'm going to uh, turn off this uh, sodium lamp now. So, and as you can see now, that just faded away very quickly. So, well, anyway, I'm going to put this uh, side lamp back on now. So, right, that's it now. The daylight lamp's back on now. So, uh, this is the video of the 250 watt high pressure sodium light bulb everybody so I hope you all enjoyed this video so please comment rate and subscribe thank you for watching everybody